Good morning! I am having some scrambled eggs with spinach and just a teeny bit of cheese. And the bean is licking his lips waiting for me to drop some eggs and spinach, I guess? Is that what you want? You want an egg and spinach omelet? Wag your tail if that's what you want. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, we just got a package! I'm so excited! We ordered some t-shirts because we haven't actually ordered our shirts in a really long time. So I wanted to show you our t-shirt haul, our tracker t-shirt haul. So check it out. First, I got the Butts 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 shirt. I love this one. It was actually designed by our friend Kaylee. So thank you Kaylee so much for designing this awesome shirt. And I got it in navy with black writing because I'm gonna wear it with my gray jeans because this kind of looks gray. And next I got the Tim Tracker Busted Tee. This is the one that our friend Jeff designed and I love it so much. I love this cut of tee, I think better than this one. And I'm actually gonna do like a review of all of the spread shirt fits, especially the women's styles. So, cause I know a lot of people have asked about that. So I figured I'd make a video for my channel about that at some point. Cause I thought you guys might wanna check it out. So. We've got this one, which I love, by the way. I love this t-shirt, this anvil, whatever cut this is, the v-neck. This fabric is super soft. I love that it's kind of like that heathered, sort of vintage-y gray look. Uh, and it just fits a lot better, I think, than this spread shirt specific style. But I did want to see how this style looked, so I ordered one. But our friend Gina actually bought our shirt in this exact cut and color, and I love the way it looks, so I got one too. Tim got the busted tee as well, and this is another spread shirt brand t-shirt. And the last one Tim got was the now it's time to pay the price mustache tee in gray. This is another spread shirt brand tee, and this design was also designed by our friend Kaylee. So check it out. I really like this one. I think this is gonna be the next one I get. And I wanna do the baseball tee that has like the colored arms. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do next. And then we got a couple more for a couple of friends of ours. We got these two, the Tracker Coaster Tee and the Neon Lights Tee. These were both designed by our friend Jeff. Jeff Delgado, I'll link his Society6 page down below so you guys can check out his other stuff. But yay, I love the mail. I love when we get awesome stuff in the mail. And I also got this guy in the mail. So this is gonna be another uh, video that I'm gonna do uh, hopefully tonight so I can get this video up and, and going on my channel. Yay! So today for dinner, we are going to have some soup and salad. We're just gonna keep it easy, light, simple. So we're doing some Tuscan white bean soup. This was from the brand called uh, Alessi, I think. I cut the thing off, it's in the trash can, but it's pretty delicious, you can get it at Publix. So what I did was, we had that weird chicken from yesterday, so what I did is I boiled that and I just kind of like shredded it up, chopped it up. So I'm gonna put this in to start cooking and then I'll add the chicken to the soup and then we'll have like a stew. Happy Thursday everybody, as you guys can see, I'm in the kitchen, there's like a weird wall behind me. We are gonna paint that wall tonight and it's gonna be awesome. There's a little couple of like down here, I don't know if you guys can see this little spot down here. I gotta do a little bit of drywall patching down there because there's a hole, for whatever reason, behind the drywall there was a, just a hole in the wall. And so I have to patch that tonight and uh, we're gonna prime the wall, paper walls, and like paint all the walls and do all kinds of fun stuff. I think we're gonna take down, there's a uh, there's a microwave over here and like a cabinet up high that I think I'm gonna take down tonight because it's too too high up for us to use and I don't really use it and the microwave's not hooked up. So just get rid of it. We'll paint back there that for that wall and it's gonna be good. Everything's gonna be awesome and new and painted and we should get through most of that tonight. Maybe, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how it goes, so. Yeah, exciting. First, we gotta eat dinner though. First things first, a salad. A delicious, delicious salad. And for our main course, we're having soup. It's like a pretty much, what, what kind of soup was this? It's a Tuscan white bean, but then I added the chicken. I just boiled some chicken and like shredded it up and put it in there. Yeah, and then we're having a little glass of wine to go with it. And then we're gonna paint. All right, it's time to start painting. We've got our primer in there. We're gonna start priming all these walls. I filled a hole right there. Sort of, and it still needs to be have another coat put on it, but I filled you another one over there. That sounded like like the hokey pokey. You got your primer right here. I filled some holes right here. We're mm -hmm. gonna, what was the next thing? Paint. We're gonna paint the walls, then we're gonna do a thing, right? Yeah. This vlog has been brought to you by wine. I can't even see it, I drank it all. And painting. 
This is like, you know when you go to the mall and they have those stores that are like, do you want to paint and drink wine? That's it. We should be charging money for this. Right? All right. Well, you owe me $20. <laughs> Guys, look how visible the moon is right now. It's like six o'clock in the evening. It's daytime, nothing too crazy. You can see here that the sun is still out. There's, the sun is hitting the trees and there's the moon. Sorry, I'm shaky. I'm trying really hard to hold it like straight, but how awesome is that? It's very visible and really cool. Oh, a bird, that was awesome. Yay. have primed the entire kitchen, painted over all of this, primed it. I know it's not like 100%, you can still see some of the yellow, but we're gonna paint with primer because the paint that we bought has primer inside of it. So this will be all good. It's happening. It is, and you guys were watching here on the time lapse, so yay. Yeah. Now, Tim has taken down the microwave and the other blue cabinet that was up here that was under this stove, which was over there. <laughs> you know that blue cabinet? You know what was in there? What? All of our Trader Sam's cups. Like, that's the only thing that was in that cabinet. Oh, yeah. Like, that's why it got taken down, because we never used those Trader Sam's. This is what was in there. It was all of our, like, zombie, zombie, uh oh, uh, uh, pearl, Krakatoa. Um, oh, these are all peanut butter jars that I saved because I was gonna put stuff that you guys mailed us, like pins and stuff in these jars and like display them because I thought it was kind of cool looking. Um, but then I just, I never put them up, so. And of course, our margarita cups. But yeah, oh, here's a Krakatoa right here. So what's under here? Oh, that's, that's a, a zombie. That's these a zombie. are these are hippopotami. Hoppa, hippopotamitai. Hippopotamitai. Hippopotamitai, that's what they are. But this was actually, this was my favorite cup from Trader Sam's. I always thought this was the coolest one. Uh -oh. This is the Krakatoa. Oh no, did you hear that noise? That was the, that was the time lapse dying. Darn it, that time lapse has died. Just when you thought you were done peeling wallpaper, right? Right? <laughs> oh no. The good news is this isn't very much wallpaper. No, we just have to, we have to peel this and paint this and then we are done. And then we can start painting with the actual colors. We're done priming. Yeah. <laughs> We're done with the preliminary. But we can do this. I'm, I think we can do it. It honestly looks so different in here. I know that like it's kind of splotchy, but that'll all go away when we finally get like an actual coat of paint on there. And you can see like this, that, that had always been there, like that little bump. But yeah. It's getting there, and we decided that we're gonna go and get new paint for the window trim and stuff like that, too. Yeah, it should go quicker. So unfortunately, the primer isn't drying as fast as we thought it would, so uh, we can't paint the actual main color tonight. Well, I think we're gonna have to wait for tomorrow to paint it, but the good news is we'll have all tomorrow night to do it, and we'll be able to get all of the coats on and everything, and like, get it done tomorrow, which will be nice. And thus, it's past our bedtime now. So, we're off to bed, more painting tomorrow, and I will see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.